I'm Abby and welcome to Eat Around Indonesia. When you ask people in South Jakarta about where to go on the weekends or where to spend your time with your family and friends, most people will definitely answer this district. It is home for the famous clubs and bars, fancy restaurants, salons, boutiques, and also sports center. It is Kemang, South Jakarta. But besides the places I've mentioned, there is one place, a pet friendly park, that became the icon of Kema. Can you guess what it is? Now, I have arrived in Como Park. Como Park is a community hub that gathers some restaurants, shops, and also cafes in one place and completed with a white pet park. Since I'm craving for some European dishes today, the first place I'm going to visit is Gelato Secrets. Let's go! This is not as creamy as the gelato. 
but this one is still good because the mango is sweet and also it has a little hint of sourness and now we will try the rose petal veggie and also raspberry It is kind of sour from the raspberry and also the lychee and you can taste a hint of the rock petal and let's try when we combine it. Let's try it. So when you combine these two, at first you will taste the raspberry, the sourness from the raspberry and also the lychee and then the after taste you can taste the sweetness from the mango. Now I will try this one. This is a uh, cheesecake and also Ferrero gelato with cone charcoal. I will try it this way. I take the cone first and then take some scoop of the cheesecake to add us first then I put it on the cone and I will take a bite of it it's kind of cheesy and there's some chunks of caramel I think and when you combine it with the cone charcoal it tastes good because the cone charcoal gives some crispiness and also crunch now we will try it with the uh, Ferrero The Ferrero is kind of sweet, it's sweeter than the dark chocolate and this one is tastes exactly like Ferrero I will try this one the same way as the previous one I will take the cone and then uh, Take a scoop of the green pea and put it on the cone and then take a bite. You can taste the green pea on this one because it gives the appearance of the green pea. And now we will try the bubble chart. This one. Uh, you can taste the charcoal from the bubble charcoal and it gives crispy from the cone. Now, let's try to combine these two. The green tea. And also the bubble charcoal. From the bone charcoal and then also bitter from the green tea and crispy from the cone. So I think this one is a perfect combination. Now I will wash everything up with this milkshake. This is the vanilla and also salted caramel and they serve it with the topping of the cream. Try it. And that it's sweet from the caramel and it's salty from the salted caramel and then you can smell the vanilla and I think this is a good choice if you want to refresh your mouth and wash everything up. Stay tuned because after this I'm gonna explore more tenants in Momoka. Let's travel and eat around Indonesia. Kan tadi aku lihat ya disitu ada banyak banget Yang kalau boleh tahu ada varian rasa apa aja sih mbak di Jakarta sendiri Kalau di kita, yang pertama di present natural ingredients uh, Yang pasti gak pake yang kita Now it's time for me to taste the first menu that I use This is the first
kita bakal ngobrol lebih lanjut nih terkait jelas pasti saya mbak halo nah aku yang nanya ini nih mbak kan tadi aku lihat ya di situ ada banyak banget tentunya kalau boleh tahu ada varian rasa apa aja sih mbak di jalan pasti oke okay. uh, di jalan pasti kita punya dua puluh empat rasa jadi ada varian yang gelato itu menggunakan susu dan itu beberapa varian sorbetto yang tidak menggunakan susu oke okay. kalau rasa rasanya boleh tahu apa aja mbak Rasa-rasanya kita ada banyak banget ya hmm. Jadi, uh, besalatnya seperti dark chocolate Itu frogberry Kemudian kita ada pistachio, ada cheesecake Ada salted butter caramel Sama ada durian, komedi Oh, gitu Terus tadi aku juga ada ngeliat beberapa rasa-rasa yang unik nih Mbak Kayak hmm. petal, hmm. terus hmm. ada juga manikom Itu kan yeah. kayak jarang ya, di tempat lain hmm. Nah, itu apa sih Mbak yang melatar belakang ini? Uh, Jadi aku pikir nih, Ih, kayaknya kita bikin rasa ini seru deh. Itu apa sih, Pak? Hmm, oke. Okay. Jadi memang jelas itu kan kita punya outline uh, ya. To every flavors tells a uh, story. Jadi setiap rasa itu punya story atau background masing-masing. Jadi seperti kayak hospital, memang kita uh, bikin dari uh, extract of uh, rose yang bisa dikonsumsi tentunya. Dan juga menjadi salah satu yang biasanya yang mungkin tidak ada di uh, tempat yang lainnya. Sama satu lagi kita ada vanilla bagung charcoal hmm. Jadi biasanya mungkin vanilla biasa ya Yang ini kita mix sama charcoal uh, Charcoal aktif yang bisa dikonsumsi itu punya banyak penggunaan Salah satunya untuk uh, toxic hmm. Oke okay, mbak Nah uh, selain dari varian-varian rasa yang tadi yang udah keren-keren banget dan uh, menarik ya mbak Nah apa sih mbak unique point dari jalan tersebut di sini juga? Kalau di kita yang pertama natural ingredients uh, yang pasti nggak pakai tambahan rasa, warna atau pengawet dan juga kita suka toko farmer. Jadi bisa dikatakan satu satunya brand jalan lokal di Indonesia yang bekerja sama dengan petani-petani lokal. Makanya dilihat dari flavor kita kan kayak ada coklat from Bali, memang kita kerja sama sama petani coklat yang ada di Bali. Ada juga strawberry dari Bedugul. Uh, jadi memang uh, memastikan bahwa siapa lagi selain kita yang mendukung produk Indonesia ya. Iya, selamat juga. Nah, uh, siapa tahu teman-teman inter yang lain pada uh, kepo nih mau untuk cobain rasanya, itu ada cabang-cabangnya di mana aja sih, Pak? Oke, okay, jadi kita ada di tiga kota saat ini, ada di Bali, ada di Jakarta, dan ada di Medan. Oh, gitu. Oke. Okay. Uh, untuk jam operasional sendiri, Pak, dari jam berapa sampai jam berapa? Kalau saat ini uh, kita Dari jam 10 pagi sampai jam 10 malam Oke, nah itu tadi ya teman-teman Siapa tahu udah pada kepo sama rasa-rasa yang tadi disebutin sama Mbak Veronica Bisa langsung datang ke cabang-cabang dari jalan atas ini sini Di jam yang tadi udah disebutin sama Mbak Veronica Makasih banyak ya Mbak For the second destination, we are going to the famous pizza place. Now, without any further ado, let's place our order. Pizza Place, the home of big slice pizza that satisfies the customers. The New York style pizza is suitable for those who crave for pizza without any hesitation to finish one box by themselves. Their pizza is also claimed to have a very soft bun and tasty flavors with an affordable price. Now, I will try the first menu that I chose. This is the pepperoni pizza and the toppings of it are some sauce and then cheese, pepperoni and also red onion. Now, I will try this one. is big so you can taste the pepperoni and then the cheese gives some salty and also savory flavor and then the sauce gives some sweet and also sour at the same time and then the red onion gives some crispy taste so when you combine everything uh, it gives a good combination because the bun is also soft 
Now, this is the second menu I choose. This is white pizza with toppings, mushroom, and then caramelized onions, ricotta cheese, and also they sprinkle some sesame seeds with also the sauce. Now, let's try it. of everything on this pizza is perfect because it's salty and then the bun is soft and then I think if you love your pizza to be salty and not sour I think this one will be a good choice for you okay now this is the last menu I ordered this is the smoked beef pizza with black olives so as you can see the toppings are smoked beef and also black olives and some sauce let's try it sour taste because of the uh, tomato sauce and then uh, the black olives give some extra texture to the pizza and then the smoked beef is taste smoky so everything combined is perfect for me I think out of the three pizzas that I ordered this one is my favorite eaters if you're feeling hungry as you watch the dogs play by, you can visit Pizza Place for a delicious slice of New York style pizza. It is open from 10 a.m. until 9.30 p.m. and it is bigger than the usual Italian pizza. Now, let's continue our afternoon shop, shall we? The last fantasy home part that I choose is mine. Now, it is time for me to try the menu that I ordered. I will try this one first. This is the So, you can really taste the banana and the banana is sweet and also the chocolate of the Nutella, uh, you can taste it but I think you can taste the banana better than the chocolate and also the uh, cheese. So, if you like to add more filling or more toppings, you can add the waffle is crispy outside but on the inside, it's kind of soft so when you combine it with everything, I think it's kind of melty in your mouth but it also gives a friend to the Now, I will try this one. This is the peanut butter cheese with fries. The 
parts are so soft and it's tender, so it's not crispy, and then it's still warm. And for this one, you can taste the peanut butter and also it's kind of salty from the cheese. So I think this is a good combination. I think they also put in some cinnamon in this one. So if you like cinnamon, I think this will be a good choice for you. And the apple gives some extra texture because it's still kind of crispy and then the cream is not too sweet. And um, the caramel gives some sweetness. Now for the drinks, I ordered apple milk and they serve it in the teapot so you can pour it. They gave you one packet for each glass, and I think for me, this is not too sweet. And I think I kind of like it sweeter than this one, but I still can't take. For the chamomile tea itself, you can smell and also taste the chamomile and it's kind of strong. Wow, what a delicious day I have in Pokemon. I tasted the friend and also unique flavors of gelato and gelato spritz, and then the tasteful New York style pizza of pizza place. And now, the soft and tender crust for my soft difference. Although I only got to explore Pomo Park, but I think Kumbang has a lot more interesting and also classical places to visit, just like this one. So if you are looking for a destination that is not facing at all, I think Kumbang could be your answer. That's it for today, eaters. Keep on following my journey to get new insights and also recommended places to travel and interact in Indonesia. I'm Abby. See you next week. Bye-bye.